So hey, welcome back to Summer Servant Fest! When we last left off, we were doing another loop, and we've reached the end, so... Which one should we do? The Melancholy of a Dramatic Demon, or our Roundtable? Which doujin would you like us to read, chat? Number one, or number two? Demon, round table, round table, round table. Alright, let's do the round table then. Looking like round table. I mean, we'll get to them all eventually. So no worries. Good morning, everyone. I know that you're all sleepy, but you need to wake up. We just got the sample copies from the printer. Let's see how they turned out. I'll open up the box. I put a lot of work into this book myself, after all. I'm so excited to finally see how Mesh Dono's idea for us all to handle separate pages turned out. Same here. This one was much more about the feel of it than the think of it. So I'm real interested in the finished product. How about you, Alter? Do you think this one came out well? Why ask me? You can just look in there and see for yourself. I really focused on polishing my artistic sensibilities for this one, so I just know it's going to be awesome. Now, open sesame! Let's see how our heartfelt poetic masterpiece turned out. Ah, yes, a slice of life featuring the round table. So heartfelt. So poetic. Ho oh, ho ho ho! Pray tell, Mesh, what is the meaning of this? Well, well, you said that you were going for a slice of life story without any conflict. So. I decided to go with the most fun setting along those lines that I could think of. Fun, huh? Well, they do look like they're having fun. I guess this has its own kind of charm. It seems to me that charm is the only thing it has. You, shut it. Damn, if only this cover had at le least turned out a little better. Who drew this cover anyway? Anybody could make the round table guys look good. And why is it so lighthearted? Hasn't the artist ever heard of dramatic tension? Uh, you drew it, Alter. I distinctly recall you saying so right before you conked out for the night. The round table? I just gotta draw those guys? Piece of cake. I can bang that out in three seconds. Really? I don't remember ever saying that. Wait, these are my files. Crap. I think this may be the most horrible thing I've ever done. Sorry, Mash, I hope you're not mad. Mad? Of course not. I love this cover. Thank you so much, Alter. I can't wait to show this book to everyone else. You, you sure? Well, as long as you're happy with it. Mm, I didn't know this was a thing you could do. I think we'd better head over to the con now. I agree. We know Double X will be showing up soon, so let's hurry and get her out of the way. Second half, let's see how well the round table doujin does. Servant Fest is open. Let's see how we do. 
All right, now that Double X is taken care of, Servant Fest is back on schedule. Mind taking care of sales? I'm gonna go see what's happening around the con. I'm gonna take a look at what the other clubs have done. See if there are any ideas worth stealing. I suppose that leaves you, Mashdono, and me to handle things then, Arujidono. Let's try to sell as many as we can. Oh, by the way, before we continue with the story, I took a closer look at the uh, the text that is on each of these uh, different doujin banners that, that are seen. Because uh, some of them are stylized and a little hard to see. So, uh, over here on the... This one, it says Pacific Moody. As in Pacific Rim, but flip Rim into Moody. Which I suppose is why it's got the kaiju set up. Uh, the Ku one says, and I, I think it says this. I think it says Wild Speed. It it's really hard to see, so I think it's Wild Speed. Uh, and the uh, the Gil and Enkidu one is today. We are also inside. So, again, seems like some sort of slice of life, light-hearted cooking thing, you know. Oh, and the little St. Quartz flag says, we it says we have St. Quartz here. Or, so, I guess you can get St. Quartz from them. Nice. And, of course, uh, I said the Astolfo one before, but it's uh, Onoko wa classmate, though, which is, uh, uh, that person is my classmate. Yada yada. So I think that that's what all of them say. Again, uh, it's a little stylized. Mostly the Ku one is kind of hard to read. But I'm pretty sure we're about right. So let's uh, continue our story. Well, good morning. Looks like I found me one amazing club. I can't believe you noobs actually finished in time for your very first con. What good little cinnamon rolls you are. I doff my parrot pirate chapeau to you fine people. Or at least I would if I hadn't come here today in my civvies. Now then, a copy, my good sir, if you please. Are you sure? It's about the round table, you know. Ah, not to worry. The genre doesn't matter to me. What matters is if the artist has vision. It can't be! What is a book like this doing here? How could I let my guard down so egregiously this summer? S sir Gawain, what are you doing at Servant Fest? I, I mean, I'm sorry, I'm so very sorry. For what it's worth, this book is a work of fiction, and any resemblance to actual servants is, um, coincidental? I promise you, we never wanted to damage the round table's good name or reputation. We just kind of made it all up. <laughs> I do beg your pardon. I assure you I was not laughing in mockery, but delight. Gouda, Mash, would you be so kind as to sell me a copy of your book? Even at a glance, I can tell from our depictions that there's a great deal of truth about us in this book. If it was in your hands that brought it to life, so much so the better. I would be delighted to read it. Oh, but please, don't tell the other knights that I was the first to purchase a copy. It would be rather embarrassing. I have my uptight, no-nonsense image to think of, after all. You also have to, like, pull your pants up a little there, Gawain. We can almost see everything. <laughs> How did you ever come up with such a manga? If I didn't know better, I'd say you were trying to get me to laugh myself to death. Not a whit of it makes any sense. And yet it all works wonderfully. 
Which one of you created this comedic masterpiece? Well, this book was a collaborative effort, but I suppose I'm technically the creative director. Oh, I see. I look forward to seeing what you come up with next. If I might suggest, how about adding a new character? It may be something of an old-fashioned tale, but what if a prince from a most distinguished family in the neighborhood who lives in the mansion next door ends up as a private tutor to the Little Lion King, which leads to them developing a lovely romance? Yeah, sure, Gil. Aha, what a wonderful thing to discover. I knew lining up early would be a good idea. Sir Bedivere, might I trouble you for another loan? As you can see, I am but a hapless poet who ekes out a meager existence through fishing. Sure thing, this makes 264,000 BB bucks that I've lent you to date. Don't worry, I'm keeping very close track. Two copies if you would, my lady. Of course, here you go, Sir Bedivere. I threw in a nice paper bag to carry them both, too. You're far too kind. I wish I could buy copies for the rest of the nights, but apparently bulk purchases are considered poor form at Servant Fest. So we'll just stick with copies for the two of us, right, Tristran? Indeed. I'm sure the other knights will find their way here in time. No doubt the first will be Gawain. Uh, my mistake. It seems there is another knight who discovered this booth long before us. Though, she appears to be reluctant to show herself. Good grief. Who would think that a seasoned knight of France would still be so shy amongst her companions? Behold, chat! Spoilers for the future. I excuse me? Is this book about the Knights of the Round Table? Th then I would like a copy, please. H how many thousands of BB books is it for one? Oh, it's not nearly that expensive. Just 50 gil bucks. Uh, I see. That's wonderful. Then I'll gladly take a copy. Best of luck to you today. Oh man, there's another new round table book here, and it looks pretty extreme. Hang on, Sir Kay and King Pelinor are a couple in this? Th th there must be some kind of mistake. Th this is repugnant. C could I please have a copy? Huh? There's an age restriction on this. I have to show ID. How dare you? I'm just as grown up as anyone else here. Oh, I didn't even notice it was already afternoon. Thirty more minutes until Servant Fest comes to an end. We still have ten copies left over, but the reception has been better than I ever hoped. I'm so glad. Now we just have to wait for the others to get back. Huh? Peekaboo. Hey, you in the swimsuit! We still got copies! Come check it out! Uh, uh, oh, hello. I just happened to be passing by completely coincidentally, of course. Uh, though I do actually have something to ask you. Have you, um, been enjoying this summer? Absolutely. Between the sightseeing and the doge and she, it's been a very busy seven days. I've been having lots of fun. Yes, it's been a wonderful time. Would you like to take a look at our book while you're here? It's more about daily life rather than any particular conflict. I see. Well, since our paths happen to cross like this and all, I think I'll take a copy or ten. Thank you. I'm glad I could find this book. We tried forming our own club, to little avail, but now I'll be able to end this trip with some fond memories. 
I'm so grateful to the servant who made this singularity for providing me with that opportunity. We did it, Senpai. He just bought most of our last remaining stock. Of course, we didn't have enough copies printed to take first place even if we sold them all. But I'm still so happy that so many people liked our book. It makes all the hard work we did well worth it. Indeed, I'm especially grateful to Lancelot. He helped us out a lot right at the end. Huh? Lancelot was here. Did he show up while I was off buying supplies? I'm sorry I wasn't able to say hello to him, but I'm glad he at least stopped by. She has no idea. To be fair... Lancelot looks real different in his summer outfit. He has a very good disguise on. Behold our round table. A heartfelt, poetic, and intellectual comedy. It is a story of an eleven-sibling family called the Round Table. By chance, this big family adopts the Little Lion King. This small-town adventure manga centers on the Little Lion King, who already carries herself like royalty, while the Round Table bothers brothers really don't do much other than stand around being handsome. Though small in scale, plenty of world-altering events occur in the story. Most of them are Merlin's fault. Merlin was really tired one day, so he stopped time. And as you can see, what are the results this time? That is one we've completed already, so it's time to complete the loop and continue farming until the next story node.